One girl walked into this garage thinking that she was going to be presented a check, but then when the curtains opened, there was a bigger surprise. Lori Mar Centron walked in thinking one thing. I thought I was going to come receive a check for the foundation. <laughs> so it's very different. <laughs> and was given a surprise she didn't imagine. A Soldier's Child Foundation cares for children of fallen soldiers. The foundation hosts camps, gives scholarships, and now gives cars. And I still am in shock. I'm trying to wrap my head around it. Centron's dad served in the military, and she always thought he would come back. So to me, that was just, well, he's working and he's coming back eventually. So I never really took, I took that for granted in some ways. She lost her dad when she was 11. She is now the second child to receive a car from the foundation through their Operation Genesis program. Centron knows that although this was from a soldier's child, it feels like it's from her dad. I just feel like it's a gift from him too. And like his sacrifice did matter and people do care about what he did. She recently moved to Tennessee, so getting around without a car has been difficult. So now her first stop. So now I'm excited to actually go to Walmart by myself. <laughs> a Soldier's Shout Foundation has another Operation Genesis scheduled for this week. In Jackson, 439 News, I'm Imani Williams.